I've been getting some questions about uh, my finger sling. My finger sling is pretty much just a shoelace with a knot in it. Um, I put it on my fingers and uh, it prevents my bow from falling onto the ground if I relax my hand in my shot, which I will demonstrate now. So because you hold your bow in a relaxed manner and your bow jumps out of your hand when you relax it, the sling is there to prevent your bow from falling onto the ground. I will explain to you now how to make this sling and how to put it on your fingers so you can do this yourself at home. You'll be needing two things, a shoelace and a pair of scissors. The average shoelace will get you two finger slings so you can cut it in half. Make a loop and put a simple overhand knot in it. Don't pull it tight just yet, so you can still adjust the size of the loop if necessary. Make sure that the knot is nice and evenly distributed. If you want to change the size of your sling, simply remove the knot and put it somewhere else. If you're happy with the size of your sling, you can now pull the knot very tight. Now it's time to actually start using it as a sling. Put your index finger and your thumb through the sling and turn them around with the sling on the inside of your fingers. Then move your fingers towards each other and slide it onto one of them. I'll demonstrate it again in case you missed it. So index finger and thumb, turn your hand around, move your fingers towards each other and slide it off to one of your fingers. This will make a loop that tightens itself when you pull it. It's sort of exactly the same for the other side. You put your index finger and your thumb through it, turn your hand around, move your fingers towards each other, and then pull the loop over your thumb. This will make a very nice and comfortable sling. So once again, index finger and thumb go through, slide it off onto your thumb, and you have a loop. It's that easy. Thanks for watching this little bonus video of Triple Trouble. Um, send it to somebody who you think needs this video and uh, leave a like if you like this video. Subscribe to our channel and see you next time.